Like this video and comment, Charles, when you're done for a special surprise. Okay. What's poppin'? It's your boy, Charles, a.k.a. Wolfie, a.k.a. More Wolfie, a.k.a. The King. Shut the f*** up. Your boy's back with another vlog. I decided to vlog today because I actually have a bunch of shit going on today. Just finished the gym, and I just want to talk to you guys about a few things. Look at this shit. I know this kind of looks like a grocery bag, but yo, this is not no grocery bag. This is this. What you know about those pre-cooked meals, bro? Come on, salmon. Look at brown rice veggies. Oh my God. I don't know what it is about LA that makes me fucking go on a diet every time I'm here. But, I mean, it's definitely the weather and the fact that everyone's fucking so deezed around here. So it's definitely motivating. But your boy's back on his meal plan. I've hit the gym every goddamn day. Right in the morning. Shout out to Ryan. He he uh, actually forced me to go. Get these, baby. Bongo is not here, but he's coming back tomorrow morning. Quick update on the car because I know I left off on like a... It, it wasn't really like a bad note. It was just I didn't know that the markup cost and some of you guys didn't understand what the markup cost and i'm not even gonna act like i know a shitload about cars but i do know a lot about the cars that i'm interested in getting because i do a shitload of research basically a markup cost is a cost that the dealership says yo we're just gonna throw this on to what the car already is so it's just like a bonus cost so when i was seeing all these like heavy forty thousand dollar markup costs i was like what the f is going on and it really even made me consider if i wanted that car or if i wanted the previous model like the 2018 one the 2019 one's like way more fucking future inside that's why I love it off but with everything that has gone on so far after I left that last dealership where they had the car that I that I vlogged that I was wanting to get things got a little more complex I had to contact a few different people and then the next morning I woke up and I was supposed to hear about a different car I still didn't get any more information about that other car and the car that I went in to go buy was sold like that's how fast they're flying off the shelves so it's like not flying off the shelves but flying out of the dealership you guys you get what I'm saying so it's stressful the past couple days have been non-stop stress. Look at my fucking laptop. I have never had this many tabs open in my life. And if you think this is it, another window of tabs. I love being a Canadian. Don't get me wrong. I love being Canadian. But being a Canadian and doing things in America is very freaking hard. I'm going to have to re-get my driver's license. I just learned that. Like, I thought my G, which because in Canada we have the G1, then the G2. So the G1 is like basically you, you did the written test. Congrats. Or like you did like a multiple choice test and you can do that at 16. The G2, it allows you to drive, but there's like way more limitations on it. Meaning like after a certain time, you're not supposed to be driving. I don't know if you can drive on certain highways and then you always have to drive with someone who has their G, which is the final one with you. Or I don't even know if you do. I got mine so long ago. And then you got the G, which I have. And the G is like, okay, hey, you're pretty much good to do anything and you don't have to retake the test until you're like literally like 70 or some shit. Out here, I know there's the DMV situation. We have Service Ontario in Canada. I don't know what the hell's going on there, but apparently, Apparently, the more that I've talked to these dealerships and the more I've talked to these people, they're like, you need your American driver's license because they think that I'm going to take the car and then flip it and like sell it in China or Russia or some shit and make profit. I don't care about that. I just want a car. But because of that, they want as much proof as they can get that I'm going to stay in America or stay in Canada. So I need my American driver's license, which means I need to do the written or multiple choice test and the driving test. <sighs> okay, enough car talk. Talk about that tomorrow when Bong goes back. Let's go get food. Carrots, lettuce, every green you can think of. Holy hell on earth. And some next no powder lemonade. I'm fing aged. See ya. Breakfast complete, healthy breakfast. Haven't had my coffee for the day yet, but whoo, goddamn, is it a beautiful day in LA literally like every day is crazy here but now I'm gonna go to the camera store I just spat but I want to pick up this little camera that I've been seeing a bunch of youtubers use and I want to test it out because if this thing works which I'll probably test it in this vlog it's a wrap I can I can be discreet and just picked up the memory card from the camera store and now just waiting on the camera please have it in stock they have hundreds and thousands of things the guy just sent me down from the third floor now on the first floor I need the camera RIP guys they didn't have the camera I'm stressed I, I thought they would have it looks like it's gonna be an online order thing or an Amazon thing but Amazon Prime is quick here and they might sell it on Amazon so worst case I'll just get it there I wanted to show it to you in this vlog though <laughs> Best basketball player on YouTube, Ryan Swayze, is not winning the game. Guys, I told Ryan I'd come to the park to support him, but I'm gonna do some push-ups on the side because I feel like shit if I'm watching these ball and I'm not doing anything. So as soon as this game's done, I gotta do 20 push-ups. But until then, let's see this. Best basketball player on YouTube. Okay. Okay. Oh, we already went to the gym this morning. This next month, I'm gonna be the most beast human you'll ever see. <laughs>
Push ups done. Change of plans, guys. I actually hopped in for one quick run of ball, and your boy is sweaty. I did it for the cardio workout. Now to go home and contemplate my card. Fucking life. Another pre cooked meal for dinner, guys. And I also ordered eight or no, 10 wings, but I ordered them from a baked place that doesn't fry them. There's no bread on them because part of me going diet Charles on your head top is yo, I'm trying to cut down, but I still want to get a little bit of the taste. So I got hot wings. There's not much calories in the Frank's hot sauce they put on it. And I still don't want to completely cut out wings, but how can I make them as healthy as possible? And this is the way. Otherwise, Otherwise, I would have gotten the freaking buffalo wing salad bit. But oh my god, they're fucking so sick from the other place that I like. What? This will have to do for now. And then a little meal until that meal. Meanwhile, some next party is going across the street. Big lineup. I didn't get invited. I'm stressed. All right, guys. So Ryan went downstairs to go get his food because he got different food than me. And I just picked up my Postmates downstairs. And in one of, uh, on the menu, I seen that they had like this ghost pepper sauce. So I was like, yo, okay, I haven't done a little prank in a minute. Mine as well. So here's my wings right here. The nice hot wings, no bread on them. I'm aged and they're baked, so they're a little healthier. And I actually had to pay a couple extra dollars for this ghost pepper sauce. <laughs> they said they made it in-house. I'm assuming they made it with ghost peppers. So I'm gonna offer Ryan one of the wings. I'm gonna put this on one of the wings. I gotta do it quickly before he comes upstairs. And then like, see you later. Smash the like button for more pranks, let's get it. All right guys, here's the wings. Which one does Ryan want? I know Ryan likes drumsticks, so we'll get him a big dutty drumstick. We'll screw up two, might as well. Actually not one, because I'm trying to eat the rest. And we're just gonna take some of this hot sauce and sprinkle it on here. I don't wanna put too much because, yo, if I actually put too much, he's dead. He's a dead man. And now we're gonna spread it. Hopefully this doesn't get in any of my cuts because if it does, I'm old. And just like this, Ryan, here it is. <laughs> You're old. This shit is fucking. I'm not gonna lie, guys, this stuff just, I mean, it just smells like ghost pepper. Once you reach a certain level of heat, it just all smells like bland shit. It's hard to describe the smell of it, but it, it, it just smells like heat. Just because I've done so many painful f***ing eating challenges, this sh is going to suck. But, you know, I've been helping you. You've been staying rent-free in my crib. It's the least I can do for you. <laughs> Let's go. Turkey burgers. Turkey burger. <laughs> baked wings, guys. I got my baked wings. Where's your where's your burger you got? Right here. Okay, okay. What the hell? Ryan got turkey burger. Why did you fries? put why did you get fries? I What's wrong know. with him? I thought he was on a diet like me, but you know what? It is what it is. These are technically skinny fries. That's my dog. So they make you lose weight when you eat them. That's what it does. Mmm. I just lost three pounds. Alright, right. right. I'm just gonna tell him you have to go and then be like, yo, do you want that wing? Casual, casual, casual. Be casual. Keep the camera low. Let's get it. You gotta cut this eye on soon, alright? Alright? Yeah. Yo, are you munching that wing? The second that. Doesn't like me a wing alive? Jeez! I only got 10, so. This is a big one? Yeah, it's a big one, guys. So vibes. That was so kind of this. Huh? What kind of this hot buffalo? Oh, can I have another wing? I am no stress. We have to leave though. Oh, soon as. Soon as. Like in 10. 10 minutes? Yeah. Of course. Yeah, it's good. It's good. You ready? Mm hmm. It's good. Well, we're like 20. <laughs> yeah, let's cut. Let's cut. Let's cut. Let's cut. Let's cut. <laughs> what? I didn't do anything. <laughs> you. I didn't do anything. snake. What are you talking about? <laughs> I didn't do anything. Chill, 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 chill. Yeah, you're you're a f***ing snake. I shut it off. They're just hot wings. They're just hot wings. They're just hot wings. <laughs> you're mine. 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 No, where's he going here? Go, go. Where is he? Where is he? Huh? No, 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 come out, come out. Come out, come out, come out. It's not mine. Are you good? <laughs> <laughs> I shut the f 
you don't like so sorry there was one there was no pepper sauce i had to do it <laughs> guys this is what happens when your friends stay here you know i'm paying for rent Fuck these i'm the boss now we'll let them die for a bit yo how you how's your boss How's your most yeah, beautiful? Yeah, shut up, you're dead. How's your most beautiful? Prank, prank war initiated. Prank war initiated? This guy said prank war initiated. Don't ever start with me. He's got three sinks running. <laughs> like, all I gotta say is one word. God him. <laughs> Look at him, he dummy the whole way. Oh Guys, I'm the best prankster around. You already know what it is. All right, we gotta go say hi to Zion. Let's get it. Impossible basketball trick shots. Featuring who? David Dobrik. What's your name? I'm Britt Johnson. Britt Johnson <laughs> featuring Britt Johnson. <laughs> oh. I'm just saying this fucking shit sucks, bro. <laughs> best or worst review t-shirt, okay? Hey, let me push her in first. It'll be best review, you know what I mean? Jesus Christ. Yeah, he's sick, he's sick. All right, guys, your boy just woke up the next morning. It was crazy. We went to Zion's house. Uh, Cause it was Zion's birthday. And then my other friend told me to pull up. I pull up and it's a full blown party. As you guys seen in the clips, they're fucking jumping in pools and shit. It's retarded. I made it home and I'm gonna end the vlog off there because today is the, the Ace Family basketball game. So I'm going to that. I need a shower, I need to eat a whole bunch of shit. But I hope you enjoyed the vlog. Bongo just arrived back in LA right now. So tomorrow's vlog is just gonna be insane guys. I love you guys so much. Smash the like button and I'll see you guys soon on Charlie. Okay, my you know. <laughs>